Good man, you can take a quick back to our, to our hotel downtown. Sunglasses as well. Phuket, is that right? Correct. Tell us about this Comrel or Community Relations it's Project now, here. It's now called the ComServe. They've changed the name of it. And it's a community service project that when the ships come in from the Navy, we try to coordinate with the community and do viable projects that uh, are good for the community. We're here at the Moang School today doing a painting project on their outside walls. And uh, we'll be here doing it again tomorrow. We've got 25 people off of the USS ComServe that are volunteering their time to help us and we'll have 25 more people here tomorrow doing the same thing. How did you choose this school? Uh, we have done a project here before. They were very appreciative. We painted the inside of the gymnasium over there and we thought this would be another uh, good project for, uh, for them to take care of. Okay. Well, tell us about USS Boxer then, your ship. What's it, uh, what sort of ship is it and how long are you here for? USS Boxer is an amphibious war vessel, uh, at least team. Ship. Uh, we uh, have 1,100 sailors, and Marines on board, a ship's crew, and then we uh, take Marines from the and then we're ready to go to take care of our nation's business. All right. Now you're the project leader for today, or the leader Actually, of your group? Actually, I'm, I'm the ship's chaplain, ship's chaplain. Uh, okay. and I just worked with these guys here in Phuket ahead of time to line up the project with the Navy League guys, and uh, ABH-1 Sutherland, Ron, is our actual project leader for today. Okay, sorry. How do you get the volunteers? Or are they real volunteers or they, they, they really jump no, at the sir, chance they to volunteers. do this? they volunteers. When we deployed back in February, I've been bothered in a good way uh, every other week for Comrail or ComServe projects and we're finally able to come to Phuket and do some stuff here in the community. So they're all volunteers. Everybody's just chomping at the bit to do something. All right. So basically the painting, the walls and the fence, anything else? Uh, tomorrow, the children will be here, so the folks that will be coming, we have a completely different team of folks here tomorrow. We'll uh, be with our Chief Sanders, one of our chiefs on board the ship, will be the project leader tomorrow. But they'll be doing some painting and also have the opportunity to take part in some recreation activity with the children. Alright. Do you think this is a sort of spiritual, uh, charitable, uplifting sort of experience for them? I think it is. I think anytime you can help somebody else, it's a good thing for you more than another person. Right. Yes, sir. And doing the hard work and getting your hands dirty. <laughs> Good to see. Hey. How are you enjoying it? Is it I'm, or is I'm it hard it. work? I'm, I'm enjoying it. It's not hard work at all because being being in the Navy, you know, you do this kind of stuff almost on a daily basis. So it's it's not really hard work. And besides, I get satisfaction from helping other people. So it's it's not really. Hard work. Right. What do you normally do on the ship? I work on the flight deck. On the flight. Man manage the aircraft. Manage the aircraft. As far as when they're on, when they're on the deck, we taxi them, we park them, we land them, we run them on the elevators, so forth, so on. Right. So this is a bit easier, is it? it this is a lot easier. <laughs> I, I can do this with my eyes closed. What about the heat? How do you, I the mean, heat? it's a, well, a really sunny, hot day, but yesterday it was raining when you arrived. Actually, right. actually, this heat here is, is is cool. It's actually frigid here compared to the flight that I work on. So. <laughs> I'm enjoying it. So this is a good day off for you? It is, it is, it is, it is. Like I said, helping other people, it's always a good day. What else do you hope to do during your stay in Phuket? 
enjoy the sights, uh, probably get a little souvenirs from my family, you know, and just relax, relaxation, that's the, that's the key word, relaxation. All right. Any hopes for your short my, stay here? Uh, yes, sir. Absolutely. My wife told me I better bring her something home from Thailand, so I'm, <laughs> that's what I'll be doing this afternoon. <laughs> Not adopt a kid or anything? No, no, no. I, I don't need a kid. I just need to make sure and bring her something home for a souvenir. All right. And any other projects the Navy League are involved in? Uh, there's a, several other ComServe activities going on tomorrow. I don't have all the details on them, but they're up north in an orphanage, and there are, uh, there are other projects being done while we speak here, so. Right. Um, the big news also, of course, recently with the, the Libya liberation. Can I just ask, you guys ever go near Libya on your, uh, no, so we didn't, your work? We didn't, we didn't go into the Mediterranean. <laughs> any, any feelings about what's going on there? No, no, so what's, I'll, I'll let the CEO talk about that. <laughs> yeah, that's, <laughs> that's, too that's, that's not our purpose here. Right. <laughs> no. Thank you. All right, exactly. cheers. Thanks for talking to us and, and let you get back to, uh, to work. Yes, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Okay. Tell us what's your name and what's your normal job on the ship? Hi, my name is uh, Tay Yelder. What I do on the ship is admin, taking care of all the paperwork and administrative duties for the command. Okay, so is this a bit more exciting than paperwork? Painting? No, <laughs> I love paperwork. Going. <laughs> It's much easier. This manual labor here, though, but I enjoy it. Just helping out the community, so works for me. Have you ever done this before? Painting? I'm sure I painted here and there before somewhere. Not that I can ever remember, though. And what do you think of the uh, the climate and the heat here? The heat? Oh, it's not bad. I've been in worse places than this before, so I think I can take the heat. All right. And you're hoping to, uh, what else are you hoping to do on your stay in Phuket? Short Here. stay. Um, I want to shop. Shop. <laughs> what do you want to buy? Yes. I want to buy jewelry. See if Je I can go find some nice uh, necklaces or bracelets or something. Obviously you're paid well then on the ship, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> I can't complain about it. <laughs> All right. Well, thanks for talking to us. And, Thank and you. Have a good keep one. Keep up the good way. So what's your name and what do you normally do on the ship? Uh, my name is Chief Select Nicholas Broders. I am from uh, Portland, Oregon, and my job on the ship is actually to paint. Uh, I'm in charge of people that actually paint, so this is like second nature to me. Oh, well, that, that's logical at last. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, what do you normally paint? Uh, we paint the ship. We do uh, maintenance uh, to upkeep the uh, preservation of the ship. Uh, so on and so forth. It must need a lot of paint. Oh yes, it does need a lot of paint. <laughs> grey, I guess, this yeah. is the colour. Yes, haze grey. Uh -huh. So does it make a change to use white today? Yeah, we make a little change to white and uh, a little bit of yellow, but uh, I got some more on my hands too, but it's alright. Can you be a bit creative? I know you're doing carefully and everything, but are you going to make it a bit artistic? Uh, this, this piece of work I don't think I can make very artistic, but uh, I, I'm not a very artistic person myself, so. I just know how to paint. But we can call you an artiste. Yes. <laughs> All right. Um, what else do you hope to do during your short stay in here? Uh, I hope to get some rest. I need some sleep. So uh, me and uh, my buddy, we got a hotel room, so we'll get some rest and uh, and uh, get some sleep. Maybe go out and see the town, and that's it. I'm ready to so, go home. So a true R&R &R, then? Yes, some two R&R. &R. <laughs> <laughs> we well, better not ask where or who with. But uh, yeah. <laughs> how much do you spend on a sort of trip like this, do you think? Uh, how much do you want to spend? Uh, I don't <laughs> want to spend any over anything over $500. So that's, $500. That's not bad. That'll go a long way here. Yeah, some shopping, <laughs> some drinks, hotel rooms. So. Right. And you're on USS Boxer. Yes. I've got to ask. Does anyone box on the ship? Do you go boxing? Uh, nobody boxes on the ship, no. There's no only, boxes. Only when you have there, fights. There may be some here and there, but not like, uh, it's not true to its name, per se. Yeah, it has another reason, I guess, why yes. it's called Boxer. Yes. What's that? Uh, to be honest with you, I don't know why it's called Boxer. I don't know if this <laughs> is there a history behind why it's called Boxer? We're the fifth ship. Yeah, we're the sixth ship to bear the name, but I don't know why it's named Boxer. So you're all a happy you bunch. Me. You never, you never fight among yourselves. Uh, we won't fight in front of you. <laughs> <laughs> Not on camera. Not on camera. <laughs> so you mean it does go on? Sometimes you know you have your uh, 
disagreements, but no, no fighting, no, no, nothing like that. But today you're a happy, cheerful, helpful bunch. I, yes, we are. We're all working and, together. And rearing, rearing to go out in the town. Yes. Yeah. All right. Cheers. cheers. Thanks all for right, talking to us. Thank you. With Kun Montri, teacher at the Muang Phuket School here in Chelong, and Jed. Uh, tell us, Montri, in in your own words, what you want to say. สวัสดีครับผมมนตรีสวัสดิเวทเป็นโรงผู้บริการโรงเรียนอบจอมเย็นวันนี้ผมรู้สึกว่าดีใจและยินดีมากนะครับที่คณะทหารเรืออเมริกันนะครับที่อุตสาเล่นเรือมาทางไกลนะครับแล้วก็มามีอาสาที่จะช่วยพัฒนาโรงเรียนนะครับซึ่งเราก็ได้รับความยินดีแล้วก็ได้รับความช่วยเหลือในงานนี้มาครั้งนี้เป็นครั้งที่2คือครั้งแรกนี้คณะฐานเรือจากอเมริกาได้ให้ความช่วยเหลือทาสีอาคารอนเนกประสงค์และเป็นสีฟ้ากับสีขาวนะให้ความสดชื่นในโรงเรียนเป็นอย่างมากและพอมาวันนี้นะครับคณะฐานก็ได้มาช่วยกันทาสีที่รั้วโรงเรียนนะครับแล้วก็รั้วภายในโรงเรียนจึงขอขอบคุณมาหน้าอกนี้นะครับขอขอบคุณเป็นอย่างสูงครับ So what did you say, Jit? Just want to say thank you very much for the American Navy to come down and help. This is the second time, and they really appreciate very much. Thank you. All right, Kapkamaka. Thank you.